Welcome back. Good evening. Welcome back to Rickster's uh, stream. And again, another adventure with Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. And we uh, left off at Chapter 3, Borneo. So out in the jungle there. You know. And yeah, the, the uh, first, uh, was it? I had a problem with uh, getting past security when it was actually easy. It's just been a while since I last played it. But um, got through that. Now let's outside and get to Borneo. <laughs> should be right ahead of you. Oh, hey, Star, how are you? How's that road trip? This one's set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. <laughs> They'll never know what hit him. Just be careful. Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. Well, I hope your trip is going well, Star. <laughs> Oh wow, sorry to hear that. Oh yeah, and I'm working with, I found out there's, um, I can make a thumbnail generator with that uh, little app uh, for YouTube called uh, TubeBuddy. So I'm kind of, pl I'm playing around with it right now. <laughs> <sighs> I'm sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? <laughs> So I have a hard time with that one. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, great! How did you um? How do you like the? How do you like the new school? Oh, hey, Renzo. How are you? Oh, there's one. I gotta have to wait till he turns his back. Well, I tried.
them down. Looks like we can swing across there. <laughs> Maybe you can. All right, hold on, Grandpa. See if I can find another way up. Oh, nice, yeah, pixel. <laughs> I think we went this way. Yeah, we did went this way. Let's see. Gotta keep pushing forward. Uh, let's see. Oh, here we are, I think. Up here. You should be getting close to the first camp. I've planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. I know, this is one of my hardest scenes, <laughs> the last time I played it. Well, there's a few other hard ones. This was a uh, one hard one to begin with. Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. If he turns his back, let me see if I can get him. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's uh, Sleeping I think Sleeping Dogs, yeah. I didn't expect to get that many views on that one. <laughs> I'm thinking I should do Sleeping Dogs like the whole like gameplay because I only did parts of the story. I think not so many. I did that martial arts club that everybody, I guess they seem to watch that.
Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Oh! Darn it! Ah, so I guess I gotta do it over again. Yeah, I think there's... Oh, yeah, here it is. I missed this one. Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is like... Uh, yeah, Uncharted is uh, exclusive to PlayStation. Uh, I want to sneak up on this guy up here, but... I want him to turn his back. If I go any closer, he's going to spot me. Let's see how many people I got. I got this one. And there's a few others. Uh, this is only available um, on PlayStation, on the PlayStation system. You know, it doesn't. It's not available on PC or Xbox. Just strictly PlayStation or Sony Entertainment. I think so. Sometimes it's just so you can buy a PlayStation. Just like Halo. Halo games are Xbox only. Xbox exclusive. Xbox, Xbox exclusives. Let me try this one. This one will shoot them quick. This is a mag. I think a mag numbers. This will kill them.
Yeah, that's unfortunate. I mean, this one, there's no multiplayer, but uh, yeah, there's some, some there's like, most of the games are like PlayStation required, PlayStation Plus required. Like Destiny is one of them. Yeah, it's true. Unfortunately, yeah, you have to pay to. But it it just depends on the game. Usually, the free to play, I think you don't have to. I noticed there was one person that's on my friend list that doesn't have the PlayStation Plus, and um, that person's playing Overwatch online. So maybe so. Come on, kid, quit screwing around. We haven't armed all the charges yet. Still got to arm three of the charges. Okay. Oh, there's another charge. Okay. Oh, right here. Here we are. There should be only two left. I don't think so. I mean, I've seen some players that don't have it, and they're they're playing it. Um, I know Destiny, you do. Uh, Destiny, like Call of Duty. Well, the benefit of PlayStation Plus, that's one thing, is you get uh, you get two free games on the PS4 a month that you can keep as long as you're a member, and also PlayStation 3, you get two free games a month. And then you get discounts, like good discounts. Come on, kid, quit screwing around. We haven't armed all the charges yet. Oh, the explosives, okay. Okay, this one's armed. And... One more, and we're out of here. No, no, um, it's just downloadable. Um, that deal, I mean, the uh, digital, digital. So, yeah, usually they're like indie games a lot. There's a few that were pretty good, um, that were free. Uh, I think one time Little Big Planet on the P PlayStation 3 was free. Oh, and then Infamous Second Son was free uh, recently. Come on over here, I'll give you a boost. All right. Come on, gorgeous, jump up. Yep. Uh, uh, you got a great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. Here you go, kid. All right. Ooh, that must have been some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. Uh, no, no, all the maps are free. You just, um, you can buy loot boxes, but loot boxes, you'll get one, uh, you'll get a loot box every time you level up. So, you don't, you don't really have to get the loot boxes. They don't really do anything. They're just cosmetic appearances. And then also highlight intros and, uh, also. No, you're okay, Renzo. I appreciate it. I like it. <laughs> here 
it down. Shit. The pop is down again. Uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe. Uh, ah! This frivolity, kid. Come on, we got work to do. What does frivolity mean? What do you bet we follow the hose? We find the camp. You always follow the hose. Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? Oh, sorry, hang on, I'll be right back. I think I see the camp up ahead. And you have found nothing. Well, well, well now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. That must be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no need, no need. <laughs> by traitors and fools! What do you say we really ruined this guy's day? Do it. Run out! Search the perimeter! Go! All right, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. Get some. Watch him out.
This Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> yeah, they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo. We bore for All right, thank you, Star. Take care. You too. Have a, have a great day tomorrow. Rest well. You know, and I'll, again, positive. Live with passion. <laughs> Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani Stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo is he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail. Back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> oh, really, Ahaka? Why not? Why is that? Shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's this? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Oh, that's the hard one. I got you covered. Nate. Well, that's convenient. Oh. Oh, sorry to hear that. Coming at you. Intruder! Intruder!
Some of this. Flush him out. Damn it. Get out. Get in it. Eat this. Okay, anybody coming here? Get some ammo. Should be this way. Sully, look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, it's the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? This place must be thousands of years old. At least. Down this way. Wow. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ooh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. I think they're all that way. They must have taken refuge here during the tsunami. There's got to be some sort of clue around here. Oh. Ah. Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried their cargo all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. More resin. 
I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. I'm just trying to follow the blood. Oh, let's see. Oh, hey, Theo. How are you? Thank you for stopping by and jumping in the stream. All these blood stains here, it's all white, <laughs> showing white with the resin. Seems to end at this wall. Yeah, it's odd. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Leads in here. Man. More bodies. Oh my god. You know, maybe I'm crazy, but it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, Nate. You're just getting spooked. Wow. Look at this. What do we have here? Careful. Nate, you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Man, is that an ugly friggin' thing? What is it? Some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a perba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet, lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah. 
Except it's not just a field of temples anymore, it's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. Oh, <laughs> right. Nice work, kid. So what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. Let's get going. I'm going to go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. Give me a hand, Nate. This way. Oh, God damn it. Come on. Harry, in here. It's Drake. What the hell are you? Get your hands up. You sure know how to pick them. Shut up, Sonny. Should have known it was you. <laughs> and you. Victor goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? You couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. They came from down there. Whoa. Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps... Between India and Tibet... One temple will reveal a pathway path to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. Oh, no. Don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. Come on, keep moving. Are you all right? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm gonna try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. Oh yeah, I gotta make a run for it. Trying to. Make him run. Oh. Oh, this way. Oh, damn. Now what do we do? We jump. Oh, hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. If we get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. Oh, come on, now don't you start this again. Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. <sighs> there they are! Oh, shit. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. said Lazarevich had a head start on us. You weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. 
Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh, yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh-oh. We got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better. Oh, it's getting intense now. Oh. Oh! Okay, now I just gotta find Chloe. Yes! Oh, that's right. I think you can throw these and then shoot at them. Parking job. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, wait a minute. I think right, right here should be smart. Oh yeah, the helicopter. <laughs> Don't want to mess with that right now. Oh, I thought there was a gun there. That was a better gun. A better rifle. Oh, darn it. Wrong way. I <laughs> got too overconfident.
Seems like I am always saving your ass. Well, it is an ass worth saving. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> oh, is that an ancient Tibetan ritual dagger in your pocket? Oh, maybe I'm just happy to see you. Hmm. Yeah, hello. So this is the key to everything. Yes, it is. Marco Polo's passport to Shambhala. What do we do with it? Ah, <laughs> I have no idea, actually. I do know Lazarevich won't get very far without it. I wouldn't underestimate him, you know. He and Flynn have been tearing this city. I'll be right back, sorry. Okay, back. Your part, they must have leveled dozens of temples already. So what's our next move? Nate? <coughs> I hate it when you do that. <laughs> Check this out. You see the symbol? Yeah. Look up there. Okay, I see the resemblance, so what does it mean? It means we know how Marco Polo found his next clue. The temple we're looking for is going to be marked with this emblem. Now all we have to do is find it. <laughs> you do realize there are literally hundreds of these temples throughout the city. Yes, but if we found a higher vantage point... We could spot our needle in the haystack. Right. There's a hotel not far from here. <laughs> Chloe, now is not the time. It's easily the tallest building in the city. Right. Right. Well, okay. That's uh, that's good thinking. Follow me. Yep. <clears throat> uh, let's see. It's no good. It's locked. Wait here. I'll see if I can find a way around. Oh, he gets. Okay, let me see. I gotta go around the other side. Whoa, just what I need. Mm, let's see. Oh, any more. Nah, is that AK-47. Yeah, it looks like that'd get me up there.
Now where is it? Oh, okay. There we go. Ah, here we are. Hey, I can see the hotel from up here. Yeah, I know, we're almost there. Oh, shit. Uh. Nah, couldn't jump that far. Okay, let's see. Ah, oh, here we are. Yeah, that's it. Uh, sorry again, I'll be right back.
Okay, sorry for the wait. I think he blew, him, blew himself up. Damn 
Damn it. Hello. I'm coming. Sorry, I got tied up. Stand back. Well, guess you had that one covered. Give me a boost. I think I can reach that ladder. Stand still, okay. Boy, it's a shame you have to sit on something that big. Here you go. Say I never do anything for you. Come on, this way. Go. Okay. Any day now. Just don't want to get skipped up. That was chivalrous, huh? Yeah, it's not dead. You just gotta ask for it. are going too well for the resistance. I don't like these odds. No? No, I think maybe we should cut over to the hotel a different way. Just avoid this crew altogether. I'm sorry, do you have a plan to go along with that grenade? Yes, I do. I'm gonna circle around this way, break up their little party. Aren't you forgetting about somebody? Well, that's where you come in, sweetheart. I need you to take care of him. But, uh, do it quietly. Do it quietly? Yeah. Are you sure about this? Desperate times, right? What does that mean? Like I'm, I'm just gonna save. Yeah, I'm gonna call it. Uh, quick conclude this this part here. So. Okay then, thank you so much for everybody. Renzo, shout out for Renzo and also Theo and Shooting Star. Thank you so much for coming by. It really means a lot. Take care, and I'll see you in the at the next adventure of Uncharted 2.